You said like when your mom told you about the natural soaps, you were like, I've been looking for this. Like what, at what point did you have this um, kind of aha moment where you just wanted to start like, you know, using more natural products, um, just less like uh, toxic chemicals, like even in the things that you're putting on your body mm -hmm. and I'm assuming inside your body as well. Mm -hmm. what, what moment was that aha moment for My you? My aha moment was when I was diagnosed with uterine fibroids. Mm -hmm. um, I was diagnosed in two, um, 2017. Mm -hmm. So I was 27 years old. So once I found that out, I started doing my own personal research in terms of, you know, possible causes, what causes them to grow, mm. um, you know, being estrogen dominant, things that can increase estrogen levels, and majority of that is artificial flavors, you know, um, things we eat. Um, soy, I found out, was high in estrogen. So with that, I was, I replaced that with meat because I stopped eating meat in 2015, and then found out, well, you have fibroids, you was eating soy, that's estrogen. Mm -hmm. You're contributing to the issue with being a black woman in addition mm -hmm. to the family history, in addition to I was on birth control. Mm -hmm. um, oh, okay, okay. So when I done my research on the possible causes of them growing, that's when I found out, no, we have to switch completely over as lifestyle. much as possible with lifestyle and um, using natural products as much as possible. Mm.